but really, I think the expectation... Here he is, the biggest heavyweight champion in history. He's head. David has made no impact on him whatsoever. He knows it's 11 times. He knows David can't say that. And I think he'll look upon that as he says so. The Haymaker! I give you an intro. They're having a clean match. Who is a power puncher? Will we see the hit and run? I would say David is the biggest puncher Balowev has faced. And what happens the first time Balowev's in mission early on, hey, trying not to get involved, pot shotting the odd shot. He could end up burning a lot of nervous energy. Just move. move. So obviously losing a lot of his power. Is to try to simulate. What Valuev will be like, like in the ring. right now. Good body shot there from Hay. That brought a yeah. quick other than Pete Rabamaker, who fought Floyd Patterson in his first fight in 56. Frustrating Valuev into making mistakes, but Valuev defends his leg. That was after his only defeat against Ruslan Shigaya a few fights ago. Blue, they wear colours, apparently, according to that night's strategy. It was red. You can't really score. The switch will move over back to that pick. Just come up for the cruiser. Oh, beautiful right hand! Oh, terrific shot there. Balloon. Well, no, that, that was the... They're happy enough in that corner. Adam Booth saying to David... Catch Hay. Hay. I mean, against tricky opponents of any description, single puncher, and in any rounds that are close, he's going to get the nod. Weighs too much. Here's the right hand again. Left up a cut. He's having to produce something he's never produced before, hey, in his career. He just been... can't time him. That good right hand again. Glancing blow, but a good punch. In fact, I think he's won the last couple of rounds. Whether the judges are giving them to him, that's another matter. Valuev, Jim, as if to say, these aren't registering. I think they might be. Yep, they're landing, that's the main thing. They have the discipline. Absolutely. Well, it's only three rounds, fair enough. He's shown loads of discipline. That's the traction engine. He's making Valoev hit thin air so far. I think Valoev may feel that his time will come. That's where Hay doesn't want to be. Trapped in the corner by the ropes and he got out of it. This is really just the opening couple of chapters in the novel. Right hand, he's getting closer to Hay at the moment. So far from David Hay that the italics are for so far. Yeah, is it impressing the judges? I wouldn't think so. Yeah, they're not good. Jab to the body from Balowev. Yeah, David missed with three shots there. And his reflexes were pretty sharp then. Balowev. Close yeah, to the ring. Static, you're fainting and then shoot fast and be gone. That's when you're landing the shots. That's Watched him studiously. They've worked on things. There's it. Two punches, three punches to the head from Hay. Again, way out of range. Taking a lot of the steam out of Balaev. Balaev fainting now, upping the pace here. And that's what Balaev has to do. He has to put punches together. More chances than he's taking. No, that's takes out. it out of you. Balaev boxing at his own pace, and those punches look well, good. Maybe Hay did open up a lead if you were looking at it from one perspective early on. Well, I have Balaev one point. This goes to show it. Open to a different interpretation. Balaev again trying to trap him in the corner. Mm -hmm. Hay is him. Yeah, well, everyone has their own methods. If he came to insult, they want good left hook. Championship fights when he's nearly always at home. The he's got him with a body shot. Yeah. He does. Another round where he has to work the whole three minutes under pressure. He's moving a little quicker. They've tried to train him for a bit more speed. Valerie, he's just doing that bit more than Hay at the moment. I think. Has happened here is that David Hay is surviving okay and he's not getting blown away. And that they'll be looking to be sure of winning the early round. Okay. 
Lewis trying to go for that left hook. Good counter there with the right hand from Valorant. Yeah, one big challenge shot, which would really be a big breakthrough for David Hay. But you really wouldn't want to rely on the three judges here in Germany. You really wouldn't. Been there a couple of times which Valorant has struggled to do up to now. Good counter. Calm in the corner. Adam Booth, the very close boxer and trainer. And what should be is it going to work? Yeah, well, the better clinching, and again, three minutes for me, it was value ever again. A good right hand. It started 10 to 11, just one sharp jab, though. Single shots in the main. You, know, hey, you want to, but uh, unfortunately. But have not found their target. I mean, he's plodding forward. I don't think you should give points. But... Yeah, but I mean, do, do you win a round with two punches? Well, I think he's winning this round. If he keeps on doing this, it'll be better. Look how much Valorant missed by then. Then a body punch from Hay. He's gaining confidence there. Rounds one up, goes back to be the last four rounds here. I don't think your local department store he starts. Well, some good work from Hay. Putting punches out. Twos and threes, Valorant. Obviously, I don't know. There's a lot of people out there who think that this uh, really is confusing. I'm good right hand again from here. Well, over here either. Follow F has not landed a punch this round. He he with a couple. He prepared to land with a third. Keep on stinging. There's a right hand from Follow F there. He almost caught Hay in the corner. Good body shot. From here. Right hand from Valoev, technique in what he's doing, not quite plodding forward the way he was doing earlier. Become a lot more positive late on in the fight here. Not allowing he to dictate the pace. Left hook from Hay there, right at the end of the round. How are they reading it in the corner, I wonder now. American writer once said in a fight rather similar to this. You can't win. No, 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 no. Bit messy. Referee. Where Valuev can lean on. That's good from Hay. Little smile. Yeah, putting into a contest. While he's walking, he needs to be thinking of throwing Hay. The leather has to fall. I mean, he's totally frustrated, Valuev, all night long. Left hook from Valuev. Good job, too, from Valuev. It's very rarely the most of the big question. Good right hand from Hay there. He's probably winning the last. Oh, good, oh. Two good shots from Hay. So he must feel like it's paper darts and against again. the mouth. Oh, he's got it going with a left hook. What a finish here. Hay gets it's David now wishing he'd gone for it earlier and tested this man's oh, only sure way of victory here. His knockout, and he's shown he's got the power to achieve that. He's, oh, he's conducting the crowd, saying, I've won this, you know. He certainly made Valoev look very silly, and I just wonder whether we're heading for How have the judges seen it? How have they read a point winner? I have Valoev two points up. I just think too many rounds of he didn't do Turning enough. To the camp, they devised the strategy. He kept to it. It probably was the only way to have a chance at the Arrayas. Now look at this again, Jim. Well, that's what we're saying. Did he have the power to shake him? And do you know that wasn't even punch. What if David Hay had landed his best shot in Valoev's chin? That was like a cuffing shot with the wrist part of the glove. Oh, look at this from Hay. He's posing like he's won the world championship. Let's... From London, England, the new... David Hay is the WBA heavyweight champion of the world! He's had a few go his way. What a...